Hey what's going on guys welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to be doing a sort of player review type video um, looking at this team this season add a Reese card. I'm probably going to start a small series and now just looking at basically the best team of the season players that costs under 100k um, just because you know players that cost over 100k you know you've got your players like Neymar, Ronaldo, um, Suarez all those team of the season players you, you know that they're going to be good if you pick them up um, so I'm basically going to be making a small series just looking at the best sort of cheaper uh, team of the season players that costs about under 100 under 100k. Um, so yeah, I'll start off the the series with um, this Adarice card as you can see. Um, he's he's really good for me. This guy he sort of um he played a lot like a poacher. Um, as you can see, he's got 80 pace, 88 dribbling, 95 shooting, 92 physical, and 77 passing. So he's got the stats to be like a really good solid uh, striker, which he was for me. Um, so I'm basically going to run you through some gameplay and show you, you know, his strengths and weaknesses. Um, as you can see, you can probably tell by most of his, you can probably tell like the main strengths and weaknesses of this card just because of his stats. You know, obviously his shooting is going to be very good and um, he's going to be a very strong player, good heading. Um, obviously not the quickest of players with 80 pace, but um, as you'll see in the video clips, that really doesn't matter too much. As you can see, he also has 77 passing, which is very useful to have on a striker, just so he can supply the left winger and right winger, or left forwards and right forwards. Um, as you can see from the formation, I play him in a 4-3-2-1, just so that he has the left forward and right forward to sort of support him um, and feed him with the three balls and all that and all that stuff. Um, personally, I'd prefer to play him in a 4-3-3 false nine, just so that he doesn't play right at the top of the pitch. But he sort of just hangs around the edge of the area, um, just so that he can get those shots away from the edge of the box, which he is very good at, because obviously his long shots are crazy, as you'll see from some of the clips in a minute. Um, he'll also have the right winger and left winger to sort of play just in front of him, um, and with his passing, uh, he can supply them very well. So I'm just going to show you a few clips of the main sort of goals he scores. Um, as you could probably guess, you know, his main strength is his finishing. Um, and his physical just because you know his finishing in and around the box wh whenever you pick it up you know that most of the time the ball is going to find the back of the net um, so that is a very good thing about this card another good thing is his strength you know he can hold the ball um, he, he can hold players off the ball he can uh, win headers he, he basically he's got all the main attributes you'd want from a striker um, so that is very good the only things I didn't like about this card, to be honest, um, was probably his pace, because obviously, you know, it's only 80. He's not going to be able to accelerate away from defenders if he's put through on goal, basically. He'll have to take it back, try and beat the defender again, and then try and find the back of the net, unless you try a long shot. But yeah, that's the main... Um, these are the main things that I found about his card, really. To be honest, in, in general, um, I really liked him. If, I think if you played him in centre-forward, he'd do a great job, you know. He'd get you loads of goals from long range, and he'd... Um, He'd be a really good. He'd be a really good player to have in your team, I think. So overall, I'll give this guy a rating of 8.5 out of 10, just because you know he's not the quickest of players, but his other attributes, you know, make him a really good striker in my opinion. But anyway, that's today's video, guys. Remember to drop a like if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you're new around here, and I will see you in the next video.